this is Zephyr, our 1961 GM 4106 vintage bus conversion. We bought her in 2011 and she was already converted. And then we did a lot of work to kind of reconvert her to our specs. We thought we'd give you a really quick tour just as we are putting her back in storage for the season. Come along. Stand on the path that I've chosen straight up. Come my way and I'll see you at the top. So welcome aboard. Uh, from, so in the 60s and 70s and 80s, Zephyr was a passenger bus and was converted to an RV in the late 80s. And this is our living space. When we first bought Zephyr, there was a dinette there. We immediately ripped that out and made it into a dual desk with awesome window views because we still work full time. And we have a pullout couch. This can, can become a bed some pillows for relaxing. We have a projector and a pull down screen on the other side so we can watch movies in here. And this is where we pretty much work and live during the day. We've got a full kitchen over here. Uh, we did rip out the stove and uh, we keep an assortment of induction cooktops and uh, instant pot there is our main cooking here as well as we have a convection microwave oven that pretty much keeps us happy with our food prep. Put in a full-size kitchen sink because it's annoying in most RVs to wash dishes in a small sink. The uh, wood in here was all from the original conversion. Uh, so all we've done is we've been slowly refinishing it. It is almost due for a lot more work. Uh, but what we loved is the storage in this hallway. There's built-in dressers. There's a pull-out pantry storage all along here. We have a 12 volt, uh, 24 volt fridge here from Vitrofugio. Uh, so we're propane free except for the generator. Testers in here, which is great. And we love the way the bathroom is set up. Uh, both of these doors open up. This one can open up this way. It's completely usable as a side bath or you can open up both of these doors and have a bath suite and people can still move back and forth from the bedroom. So it's a very flexible floor plan, kind of more boat-like, which you know, we like boats too. And then our bedroom, one of our requirements was a walk-around queen bed after years of crawlover beds. So we have a walk-around queen bed, the freshwater tanks are underneath the bed. And behind the uh, mirrors, those are doors, and there's a big closet back there. So we have a lot of storage space on board Zephyr. And of course, all of the luggage bays underneath can store a heck of a lot of additional stuff, including large holding tanks that can keep us comfortably boondocking in Zephyr for three or four weeks at a time before needing to dump, which is awesome. So thank you for coming aboard Zephyr. I hope you enjoyed this tour. Uh, if you want to learn a lot more, we have fully documented most projects on Zephyr. Go to technomadie.com slash Zephyr. create these videos just for fun and we'd love having you along for the ride. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up, leave a comment, or if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. See you next time.